Yo, 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 what's going on, guys? Welcome back to another video. And today we're gonna be doing another taste testing video, um, as you can tell by the title and thumbnail. But before I get to that, uh, I don't know if you guys have questions on why I'm always wearing the same exact hats. You probably don't, but if you do, I'm gonna clear that up for you guys. Uh, I'm all, I'm actually I'm actually not always wearing the same exact hat. I have actually three over there. Um, I have one right there. It's a reverse flash. This is a flash. Um, so uh, yeah, back to the video. So I picked this up at Circle K. I picked this up at Circle K yesterday, last night I believe. Um, alongside Mountain Dew Do SA, which I'm going to be doing that in the next video. Uh, but yeah, by the title of this video and the thumbnail, you can probably already guess that I got this. I, it's called Mutant Super Soda. It looks like it's made by Monster. I don't know. It looks like it's made by Monster. Uh, possibly. It says, there is nothing soft about this drink. Mutant is a definite new breed. Uh, I think that says definite, but new breed with an attitude all in all its own it's the evolution of a sparkling refreshment the perfect balance of a drinkable and energized flavor so it's red dawn they actually made a red dawn uh movie uh, i don't know if that has to do with anything like that but what i'm gonna do is um, okay well let, let me see the calories and shit i don't even know if it's okay calories 290, which is the most fucking sodas, right? Uh, caffeine content, 115 milligrams. Woo, boy! Okay, so guys, the only reason you clicked on this video is for me to try this new drink. I'm not sure if it's new, but it's new to me. I've never seen it in Circle K or any store for that matter. Um, so let me try this and give you my honest opinion. I want to do the smell test because I know most people do the smell test. So, um... When I when I uh, took the cap off, it honestly started smelling like a Mountain Dew. So it smells kind of like a, I don't know if it's a bad thing, but it smells a lot like a fucking cologne. Yeah, it smells a lot like cologne. Like I'm gonna I'm gonna actually here. Hold on. I don't know if that's a bad thing, but it actually st smells a lot like this. Yeah, it actually smells a lot like that. I'm not sure if it's a bad thing. No, I'm not even joking. It smells like Mountain Dew mixed with uh, that clone. So, okay, let me try the. Let me, let me do the taste test now. I did the smell test, then we'll do the taste test. All right. get the lighting for the thumbnail okay so um yeah this I'm trying to get that thumbnail though you know but honestly it's pretty damn good I'm not gonna lie it doesn't taste like a fucking monster it doesn't taste like a monster at all um but yeah uh, it doesn't taste like a monster at all it actually tastes like um Like, like they mix monster with like Mountain Dew, you know what I mean? That's exactly what it tastes like. Uh, it's I mean, would I drink it? Would I drink it a lot? No, I don't want to get a heart attack. Would I drink it a lot? No. So that's for you guys' question. If I would drink it a lot or even drink it after today, probably not. I mean, I would drink it maybe like once or twice a month, but that's pretty much it. I would rather drink a monster than this. Um, but yeah, uh, my honest opinion, I would probably give it, since it, since it tastes a little better than a monster, I mean, a little better, uh, you know, that much, I would probably give it, like, like last video, 8 out of 10, or maybe even an 8.5 out of 10, only because... Yeah, it just tastes like a regular soda. 
the more I taste it, the more it starts tasting like Mountain Dew. I'm not even joking. So, but yeah, uh, hopefully you guys like it. That was my, um, you know, review and taste test on uh, Mutant Super Soda made by Monster. But yeah, so hopefully you guys like it. And um, yeah, pretty much. If you guys want me to do the whole taste test on the uh, Mountain Dew Do SA, let me know down in the comments down below. Uh, I mean, I already have it, so chances are I'll, I'll probably already post it anyways or make it. But yeah, if you guys want to pick this up for yourselves, uh, I the only place I know they would have it is like gas stations, uh, or I don't even know if they have it at QT or Circle. I know they have it at Circle K. I'm not sure if they have it at Walmart. Uh, but yeah pretty much I mean it's pretty damn good I gotta say so enough talk about how good it is uh, I'm just gonna you know end the video right here uh, before you know I start rambling on about how fucking good it is because we all know I would probably do that so um how much sugar boy it has 72 fucking grams of sugar in this bitch. Holy shit. The most thing, the, the, the one thing I have actually drank that has this much sugar, I don't think I've ever, I, I've ever, I can't even talk that much, how much sugar got in my body right now. But I, um, I haven't drank anything like this with that much sugar. I don't think I ever have. The most sugar I've ever drank in a drink was like 62 grams. That's, that's a lot of sugar right there. Holy fuck. I did not realize that shit. Hold on. Hold on. I'm gonna go see how much sugar is in the other one. Alright, I'm back. So. Let me see. 45. That's, I mean, that's pretty good for a drink that has, like, all three, you know, flavors combined. Um, but yeah, like I said, if you guys want to pick this up, I'm not sure where they have it at. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. That's pretty my review on Mutant Super Soda. So hopefully you guys like it. Uh, smash that, um, you know, notification button so you guys be notified every time I make a video or release a video. But with that being said, I'm going to end it right here. So yeah, take it easy. Bow.